Greetings, everyone. I'm Dr. Supratik Bhattacharya. I'm consultant endocrinologist based at Kolkata, and I'm going to share with you real-world experience with the Impelina fixed dose combination. So I must say at the onset that I have an extensive experience of using this molecule, and quite a significant number of my patients are on this combination because of the ease of use and at the same time, because of the Empelina fixed dose combination being a very small pill, which is very easy to take, and uh, without any specific timing to the meal, it's very, very convenient for the patient, and that's why it increases the compliance as well. Besides, we know that individually, Empagliflozin, as well as Lenagdiptin, does have very robust data in terms of cardiovascular as well as renal safety. So with this background, I want to share some of the real world clinical experiences that were generated by using this fixed dose combination in uh, clinical practice. So the final uh, real world uh, data that I wanted to share is in those individuals who are affected with mild to moderate COVID, which is just like any other viral uh, flu that we commonly encounter in our clinical practice. In these individuals, if we continued Empelina without um, any dose modification or stopping the Empelina combination, we do get to see that these individuals maintain their glycemic targets and at the same time, recover faster as compared to their peers. So efficacy and safety of Empelina combination in non-hospitalized COVID-19 positive patients with type 2 diabetes in real world setting uh, was uh, presented at uh, the end of, it uh, was presented at ACE annual meeting, which was held in May, 2021, and also published in endocrine back practice. So, the take home message from this particular study was if you are having any individual who is having a viral flu or a, a mild symptomatic COVID-19 infection, you need not stop the Empelina combination and you should actually continue with this uh, along with the conventional therapies because that would help the person to recover and maintain the glycemia throughout the period of their sickness. So uh, thank you so much for your kind and patient hearing. And it was lovely to be here. Hopefully we can come back with some more interesting uh, insights later on.